<laughs> we don't use the bingo balls by the number. We go by the colour <laughs> on the balls. <laughs> this is getting worse. <laughs> so horse number one has got blue balls. Well, no one's perfect. <laughs> I'm having a fight with an Eskimo. There you go. And that would go down with... Oh, he's got one of his balls. There you go. <laughs> and he goes back. <laughs> Last time I had a grip, they recorded it in the Doomsday Book. <laughs> yes, it is that long, folks. There you go, and it'll go down the track like that. You can watch the progress on there because uh, when the jockeys are doing the wooden horse, it's just for a little bit of fun. But you watch the actual progress of your hard-earned money up there on the board. Now, horse number two is hard on, <laughs> dear, and that's the. Blue, the red one going down the track like so. Horse number three. Oh, Mary, there she is going down track number three. Horse number four. <laughs> the Queen's Lament. I needed it. There you go. Going down track four. Oh, don't we all? And horse number five is the famous. Horse number all right, so you can speak French. <laughs> you're doing this right, you can't speak with your mouth. Look at 69. He's got yellow balls. So it's Chinese, what the hell? There you go. <laughs> you're all as crazy as me, do you know that? Thank God. Okay, that's the five ponies on the track. And the way you bet is you come up and see our lady bookers here. Bookers, we said. The girls doing their own time is their own business. First of all, this is Mary over here on my right, Mary with the dark hair. There she is. Let's hear it for Mary. Yay! And this is Jackie, another lady booker. So there's for Jackie. That's Jackie. And around the room is Daily Double Rebecca. Come on out and see you, Rebecca. There you go, girl. Mind the wire. Don't trip. There's the lady with the red ticket. So the Daily Double is this. If you choose the winner of race three and the winner of race four, the best thing to do with a daily double is to box it. So yeah, after the show next one it to you, she's got more hands than me. Yeah? It's a little down. That's how difficult I tell you. Well you choose say you choose horse number one in race three and horse number five in race four. Buy another ticket, flip the numbers around. Woohoo, that sounds like fun. And then you've got a daily double box. That's the way it's done, and that way you have your chances, yeah? So wait four dollars at Becky and she'll come and do it at your table. Also sell you a ticket. Alright, now the betting windows are open, come up and place your bets with the lovely ladies right here on the stage. You're recording this? Yes, we're about to. Idiot sheet here. <laughs> Should remember that. Now, we can't do the uh, racing, of course, without our riders. We've got two very special riders from our show. If you saw our show earlier, you'll know these two young people here. Little lady who is the right height, right weight and everything for her jockey. There she is. Let's hear it for the lovely Mel. How do you find time to knit those sweaters in the afternoon? She's a busy lady, you see. All right, I'm one of the tallest jockeys in the business. There he is, on his stand. All right, there we go then. Let's block those. <laughs> okay. Now I need your help now, because on account of three, I need you to yell as loud as you can. They're off. <laughs> Think what you like of that statement. <laughs> no, they're not. They're still on. Here we go. What the fuck? Here we go then. For the first race of the evening. God help me if I remember these names, I'll tell you. <laughs> I got the new team thing, that should be alright tonight. Here we go then. And the first one away from the post. It's number two, Aaron. It's number five, Swazzle Murph. It's number two, Aaron. But it's number one, the Diesel Dyke. It's a double for Oh Mary. Oh no, it isn't. I'm sorry. It's a single for Oh Mary. And it's number four. Thank you. Uh, 